So I've seen online people asking if leech can kill a tree. So in this video, I'm gonna find out if it actually works or if it doesn't, so stay tuned. Hey guys, my name's Steve. In this video, I'm gonna test and see if bleach will actually kill a tree. Now, there's a ton of myths and rumors online about things that actually kill trees and things that don't. Um, I think the biggest reason why is there's a lot of trees that actually don't need to be treated to die. Um, for example, all pine, conifers, evergreens, all those kind of trees, and there's a lot more, um, they actually don't need to be treated with anything to die. As long as you cut off all the branches, cut it down to a stump, the tree is dead. So if you treated a stump that was already dead with bleach, obviously it would die. So there's a lot of misinformation online about what actually works and what actually doesn't. So to figure out if bleach will actually kill a tree, I'm gonna test it out on this elm tree right behind me and uh, see if it actually works. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna chop it down. So what you wanna do is pour the bleach on it right away. Um, if you let the stump heal for like 30, 40 minutes, even a couple hours to a day, it won't be as effective. So I'm gonna cut it and immediately treat it with bleach. So let's get to it. Okay, so now the tree's cut down. You'd really, all you have to do is treat this outer cambium layer. You can see this little layer just right there, which is called the cambium layer. This inside is what we call the heartwood. So this is actually dead. There's no nutrients flowing through that. So you have to poison this outer ring of the tree. So normally with a good tree killer, all you really have to do is paint the, the tree killer onto this stump. And if you check out in some of my other videos, you can see where I do that. But in this video, I wanna give bleach every chance it's got because it's a cheap product you can buy anywhere and so i'm actually going to drill holes around the outside of the cambium layer you don't really need to do that but i'm just going to do it just to see if we can get a little more bleach see if we can get some more uptake of the bleach see if it'll actually kill this stump man that thing worked awesome i love that drill bit so see if uh see if that'll help at all <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's enough bleach, I hope. Well, I treated that with bleach. Let's see if that actually killed it. Okay, so two years later, this is the tree that I treated with bleach. Um, you know, it looks pretty dead around here, so I'm actually kind of surprised. However, there are little shoots coming up around this, but I'm not sure if these are coming up from this root system or if they're just new seedlings that were left behind. So they could be seedlings or they could be coming up from the roots down here. But I would actually, I'm actually thoroughly surprised that the bleach worked this good on an elm tree because these are really tough trees. So I would say that bleach worked. I mean, even if these trees these smaller trees right next to it are from the same root system and not from just new seeds. Um, they're really small and in two years if this is all that's grown, then that tree really struggled um, coming back from that bleach. So I would say bleach was a success. Even if this tree is not completely dead, it killed quite a bit. So I'll put all the links in the description for all the tools and products I use in this video so you can have uh, quick access to those. But uh, also make sure to subscribe to this channel because I put out new videos every week on how to kill trees, how to remove tree stumps, how to kill tree roots, all that good kind of stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching and we will see you next time.